morning world. I'm back again. The truth. My topic of the day is the time is getting near. I'm gonna get straight to it. The time is getting near. See what's going on with the world today. A lot of hate, a lot of war, a lot of wars going on over land, or you, and stuff like that. It's prophesied in the Bible that Babylon the Great, which is America, is going to be in flames. Just like the UK and Israel or Russia and Israel fighting over land that's not even theirs. Russia got nuclear missiles that's ready for war. That ready, they ready to press that button. Just like Korea, they ready to press that button on Babylon the Great, which is America. I'm not an American. I'm an Israelite. I'm not an African American. I'm an Israelite. And all of, all of this is in the Bible. And I know I made a lot of videos based on the children of Israel, which is my black, Latin, and native Indians. We are the 12 tribes of Israel. And according to the Bible, we got inheritance in the kingdom of heaven. The Chinese, the Japanese, the Arabs, the white people, they don't have no inheritance in the kingdom of heaven. Wonder why? They got so much power today with lands that don't belong to them. And people not waking up. People still sleep thinking the white man is going to help you. He is not going to help you. If they was going to help you, they would have been helped you. Um, JFK was trying to help, but he didn't really help. And then his brother was trying to, um, do away the, um, the, the, um, the bill that was signed that JFK signed off, but his brother wanted them to um to cancel that that bill because his brother died. That goes to tell that they don't they don't want us to have no kind of rights. And far as like voting, I'm not voting ever again because nothing changed. Nothing changed. Like, like we still in the same predicament. Not even Obama did anything. And he was black. And he was 
also a homosexual. But nobody ain't gonna speak about that. And he also signed that gay rights. What can y'all say about that? That's against God's commandments. That's that's a um that's an abomination. That's solemn and Gomorrah shit. Knowing that we basically killed that whole land based on them doing Solomon and Gomorrah shit. So just imagine if y'all doing that shit now. And you thinking God is blessing you with all the blessings that you happen to be getting. God is not hammering you. And I'm telling you that it's time to wake up. And it's time to read the Bible and learn for yourself. We are the children of Israel, my black, Latin, and native Indians. The Bible is not for white people, Chinese, Japanese, Arabs, none of them. And there's a lot of people that's following the Quran, knowing that... Um, that guy Muhammad basically couldn't read or write, and he was also a slave driver trans transporting Israelites to another land. And know your history. That's what people be following. You can't be following, following people that that's doing black people dirty, Latin and Native Indian people dirty, and everybody want to do the Quran, knowing that the book on um, the Quran they was telling you the children of Israel is the chosen one. They already had that in the Bible. I mean the Quran. And the Quran, basically like Muhammad was around the Israelites learning their culture. So he wound up making his own culture based off somebody else's culture. Knowing that Quran... It's bullshit. I know there's a lot of people probably like, yo, why are you saying that? Name one thing that Muhammad prophesied. And he also had a, 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 a nine-year-old wife. His wife was nine years old. Wonder why this R. Kelly shit is going on out here. Because niggas been doing that shit. And it was never the children of Israel doing that. It's always from white people to Arabs to whoever else. We was never doing things like that until you start following other people's customs of heritage, of history, and start doing sick shit. But knowing that we never started it. The time is near. Keep fucking with them Arabs all you want. I'm cool with them. You know what I'm saying? Keep fucking with these white people. You know what I'm saying? I got a white attorney. Of course I got to fuck with him until this shit is over with. It's not like I'm calling him and talking about we need to hang out. I ain't doing none of that shit. You know what I'm saying? That's all I got to say about that. The time is near, and it's time to wake up. That's all I got to say about that. Good day. God bless.